Hey, what's up? It's your man, Flo Rida, and I'm taking you through the hits list for ET Live. When I first heard Low on the radio, definitely a dream come true. You know, um, got tons of phone calls. I mean, it's, it's, it never stopped for quite a while, you know, but, um, you know, shout out to DJ Khaled, who was the first one to play the record, you know, on the radio. You know, it was just one of those things where I felt like, you know, uh, here it is. It's, it's about to be a nonstop party around the world. Definitely, I recall just being in the studio and immediately when I heard the 808s, T-Pain just giving his melodic style to, to the record. You know, it initially just got me up off my feet. I'm not even a dancer. The club can't even handle me right now. Club can't handle me. Everybody knows the club can't handle Flo Rida. <laughs> Shout out to uh, my brother David Guetta. You know, it's like one of the first records that I did as far as like EDM goes. It transcends uh, over to the stage from all the energy that we had in the studio creating it. You know, so Club Can't Handle Me is definitely one of my records that I, I look forward to the crowd just losing their minds. Wild wow ones. Shout out to Sia, to her electrifying voice. I mean, the first time I met her, and I got a chance to, you know, hear a preview of the record. I fell down to the ground like, thank you so much. She was like, wow, what's up? I was like, this is, record is going to be so huge. Girl, I'm going to show you how to do it and we start real slow. Whistle. First, it was a melody. And um, the production was like a little bit different to the normal, you know, a little slow down um, tempo. I recall going out in Acapulco, Mexico and, and shooting a video. It was very hot out there, but, you know, the fans and everyone there were embracing the record, you know, just as myself. They they took the initiative to make the initiative to make the sacrifice to be all out in the sun and, you know, was singing along and, and made this a chart topper. It's going down for real. It's going down for real. Shout out to my brother Sage the Gemini. You know, um, I recall sitting in the studio and he insisted that the that the lyrics needed to be going down for real, and he he definitely um, stood his ground on that, and I co-signed. And shout out to my brother Udonis Haslam who came out for the video down in Miami. A couple of the kids around the way, the, the hip hop kids, and um, my uh, dancers, you know, who go and toured me around the world, the wild ones. We had uh, the guys and the girls competing against each other, you know, um, Offset, you know, uh, when we weren't shooting. And um, it was definitely one of those uh, things where I had to show him who had the best jump shot. Hola. Yeah, man. Um, just growing up in Miami where, you know, it's a gumbo of different cultures. You know, I felt like I needed to do a record that, you know, shows that I, that I embraced the Latin community really well. You know, I went outside the box to uh, work with Maluma. Shout out to Maluma. You know, it's my first time going to Colombia. Went out there and, you know, had a, a great time. You know, um, didn't get a chance to stay there long. I look forward to going back. I have a lot of collaborations that stand out. I think, you know, I didn't get a chance to work with her in the studio, but to have gotten a chance to uh, work with Lady Gaga on her very first record, Starstruck. You know, I, I think that stands out because, you know, I had no idea what her career would be like, but initially when Akon reached out to me to do the feature, I was like, of course, you're my brother. Not knowing that I'll be, you know, um, doing a record with someone who I look forward to being a legend. I think my favorite song um, to perform, but I think performing the record, I Cry, you know, I mean, that record right there represents, you know, the tears of joy, all the hard work that I put in, you know, all the countless hours and the sacrifices that myself, my friends, and my family have made to um, give me the opportunity to have the platform that I have. A lot of times you get party records from me, but that record right there is something that, you know, is a little tearjerker for joy when I'm performing it. But make sure you check us out on tour July 23rd. There's myself, Nelly, and TLC, man. You don't want to miss it. The summer's going to be really, really hot. Go to Live Nation right now to get your tickets.